started sir please yes dear students hope you have joined this uh, webinar this is the special webinar which we have uh, organized today uh, with the help of uh, dr jadav vaishali jadav and today's guest is victoria ma'am as every year we are seeing that our students are going abroad or overseas for higher education for doing their ms or mpharm and the things are not properly planned or coached or you are not aware and in last few days we had several meetings with various organizations and one of them is athlon institute of technology aip ireland university and we are in the process of signing mou state uh, all things but dear students you should have all idea about how you can get admission to that courses how is ireland how the things are there for uh, with reference to studies abroad or education overseas so today we have organized this special webinar series for you dr vaishali ma'am will introduce you with reference to dr victoria but i would i would like to tell you that during last several days you have been hearing uh, different webinar series and through this webinar series we are trying to motivate you educate you with reference to an entrepreneurship development or say for uh, product drug, uh, drug development or drug designing and various things related to pharma curriculum which is followed in india as well as abroad today this is a special event so that from my side i would uh, like that our student should study abroad uh, and pursue their higher education every year Uh, around two to three students or four students maximum they go abroad from our college more than 20 to 25 students are studying uh, and also working at different positions and we have seen that they have uh, developed themselves very well they have been educated well and they have started their career nicely and you should also follow them if you are interested in this how take advantage of this and you should take advantage therefore we are signing a memorandum of understanding with uh, athlon institute of technology ait ireland uh, we had meeting with carl sir who is director of international relations and today we have victoria ma'am she will guide you motivate you and encourage you regarding this i uh, welcome dr vaishali ma'am and guide the student accordingly vaishali ma'am thank please. you yes thank you sir uh, it's my pleasure today to welcome victoria madam victoria sukhia madam uh, for uh, giving this talk today uh, i would like to introduce you madam first of all uh, miss victoria sukhia has a has completed her masters degree in science in animal physiology physiology from mumbai university a masters degree in business management in marketing and sales uh, that she has completed from mumbai university and an iit a diploma uh, that she has completed from swiss so overall she has an 24 years of experience in education counseling career guidance and overseas university consulting She has personally facilitated overseas higher education for more than 500 students. Uh, Madam is working with Southern Seas Education, which is based in Pune, and uh, it is an India-based international education boutique with over two decades of experience and a stellar track record of placing students in university abroad. So, with this short introduction, I would request Madam. uh victoria to please uh take the further talk and uh, start with her lecture 
and uh, also i would request all the students please hear today's lecture properly it will be really very uh, beneficial for you all okay madam over to you a good evening to you i uh, as uh, introduced i'm uh, uh, handling southern seas education for the last 24 years and we've been uh, directing students abroad to all different countries we had the opportunity of connecting with um, vaishali madam and uh, so hence we have uh, tried to tie up with athlon institute of technology which is located in athlon ireland uh, it's one of the uh, i'll share with you a powerpoint presentation to let you know that it's uh, been the third time uh, appointed as a good university guy in the new good you know as a top university uh, for 2020 institute of technology for the 2020 it's got a third award again this year this uh, slide which i'm sharing you is act, uh, sharing with you is uh, the convocation for graduation ceremony uh, at the institute which i was present also in october 2019 um athlon of uh, it uh, it's uh, one of the tech, it's going to be a technical uh, technology university very soon and it has 50 years it has completed years in uh, uh, this year i'll share with you you which is you will see the president and this is a president professor skirin it shows you are the the campus and where exactly it's located in ireland these are some of the facilities available with the different departments that's the graduation ceremony this is sporting facilities available on campus Now, AIT is located. It's called Athlon Institute of Technology. It's called AIT, which is located in the right in the center of Ireland. Um, this it has about six thousand with sixty-two plus nationalities, uh, four faculties. They uh, they have. a tie up with about 230 partnerships with various universities and research institutes around the world so you see some of the countries where they have the partnership ait has a partnership with all these countries in member of the european union you euros is the national currency they have a population of only 4.8 million people 70 million irish people call ireland that means those are 70 million it's located right in the center of ireland and one a uh, our distance from the double from that is the capital of ireland it's a drive of one hour to athlone
the government uh, they have the government funded institutions and the fees are affordable uh, they have a lot of work uh, uh, in their teaching methods there's a lot of work related and research oriented uh, study extremely safe and friendly country which is the sixth safest in the world on a student visa you are allowed to work 20 hours part time studies and 40 hours in semester break the minimum wage in euros is about 9.85 per hour you 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 get paid part time for your studies this is Clon McNoise, which is one of the very famous sites of Ireland. In Ireland, there are 19 publicly funded higher education institutes, and you can see they are located all over Ireland, and only one in Athlon. This is a the state of the education system. So when you have completed your four year, you would be on level eight. So the pro, uh, postgraduate master's degree is level nine. You will that's their national qualification authority of Ireland framework. The reasons they have given seven great reasons to choose AIT. One is the it's uh, the Institute of the Year for 2020. Also, they have a lot of work placement. That all the graduates, 93% of them are employed. Complete study. Study. They study a semester. If you are interested in a longer program, there's a study abroad semester also involved. The study is industry focused and it's an affordable cost of living because it was you can live in a single room for about 70 euros a week. It's centrally located and they have the state of art facilities at all the campus 63 percent of the honor students graduate with first class now this would interest you all these are the it's one of the top 25 in the world research based um it's first in um uh, it's accredited to the APS. I'll just go back. It's got an accreditation of um, to the APS, that is a pharmaceutical society. They have a lot of research um, available right up to PhD level in your field, like toxicology. We can share with you the course guide, which gives you all about Ireland. These are the various levels. So you fit in level eight, and you, for the masters, you will reach level nine. This is on the science and health faculty. The master's program is no will be called MSc in Biopharmaceutical Technology. These are some of the research partners of AT all world. So you can see bioscience, they have a lot of uh, med schools for research partnership. This is the campus. Uh, these are the various, the entire campus is here. You, the main campus is here. I mean, this is the main building. You, you have the arena, international arena here. Uh, then they have parking, students, union. These are various uh, buildings in the campus, on campus. 
they have invested about 150 million euros on this camp so if you can see this is the sports arena they have the various buildings this is the new stem building engineering building nursing building this is a picture of picture theater the college life now college life what do you get so you have entertainment you have beautiful scenery so outdoor fun you have culture history cinema being treks and trails so there's a lot of things to do extracurricular activities apart from your studies available for students. This is the accommodation. Now this accommodation of campus opposite the gate of the campus. So you have these rooms. If you will see, uh, you have apartments with a common dining and a living room. Uh, this is a typical room if you would like to see a bedroom, which will be your room with the wardrobe and a study. It's cheaper than uh, Athlon is cheaper than Dublin, 55% cheaper than Dublin. Although Dublin is the I main, uh, uh, is the capital of Athlon. The cost of living in Athlon would work out to around 7,500 euros per year. That is including of accommodation, food, and, and so that works out to round about it. That's about six lakhs a year will be your food, living, and everything. But this is what is like to show the visa office students are living in 5000 euros per year but if they take their own food these are the supports from ait for the students you have tutor support that is private classes if you can't understand they can they give you private tuitions which is uh, not charged i mean it's part of the course fees then to write your assignment they have academic writing mentors are there to help you cope up with homesickness or things like that to help you how to go about and your guidance that is how to, what to do after your program those who have disabilities learning disabilities there is provisions for that now, these are some of the sports and societies which are available as ent uh, for you extracurricular activities apart from studies. They believe that you should have an overall growth. This is the football field on the campus. This is some of the soccer tournaments they have had. These are art and culture society clubs where you can become, as a student, become a member of these societies. And uh, this is but, uh, showing you that 94% of the 2017 graduates were employed in training or further studies. These are some of the AIT graduates around the world. You have all over the world, they are employed. Now, the program you are looking at is the MS in biopharmatical, uh, this a uh, pharmacy. Or a master's pro degree and on completion, you will get a two year 
the post study work permit to work in ireland the costing the tuition fees like for post graduate is about 12000 euros per year but since you have a tie up with ait is an mou between the your college and ait you would be entitled to a merit scholarship of 2000 euros so your fee is down about 10000 euros per year which is around 8 lakhs of rupees and the living expenses is 7500 per year which is required to be shown for the visa to, that you visa office that you have this much money to live for one year what are the requirements your requirements is an english language test so you would come under 6.5 ielts with no sub score before below 6 now is english it's an international english language testing system whereby it is conducted either by british council or i australia so it tests you for your skin listening writing and reading four components of ielts you um, you require 6.5 over and no sub score below 6 now this ielts can be either given in on a paper based uh, examination or on a paper based so they paper based they have two session uh, exams a month available to appear whereas a computer is available every weekend uh um, just now because of the covid 19 situation uh they are not um, having exams there is another alternate exam called duolingo but subsequently they are expecting to open up in september by july september and um, we we are the british council registration center so we'll assist you in registering for the ielts if you are interested in going in the september intake next year you need to for the ielts by january and, and uh, once you register you will get access online for free uh, for um, free of this mock tests and uh, access to all the materials to start of the education why ait okay as you can see it's right in the heart of ireland it they have personalized and friendly services from the international office and the academy of they have a writing center affordable fees scholarship opportunities are available extra support even the cost of living is cheap and you get two years post study work opportunity to stay in ireland Ireland is a hub for the pharmaceutical industry so basically you have a lot of uh, uh, nine out of 10 uh, companies top 10 companies of the pharmaceutical industry is located in Ireland they all have their branches there and therefore the opportunity to work after your masters it's immense i mean you have a lot of opportunity to find a job and work in Ireland what does southern seas education do we offer assistance right from the application process to getting your letter of offer the admission letter the visa process booking accommodation ticketing pre departure orientation we tell you how what to carry with you how to settle down in that country what because normally students have a culture shock going to an european country we also organize an airport pickup so when you land somebody will be with you take you to your accommodation and you get your life from there thank you this is our contact details basically but um, vaishali madam will also give, be able to assist you with this
Yeah, madam, have you done with your presentation? Yes, I finished with the presentation. I'm ready to take up any call uh, questions. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I request you to please come to the streamer window. Yes, I've come to the. Is this a correct window? Yeah? You can see me. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, it's visible. Uh, so uh, here is the first question. Yes. Yeah. Um, um uh, AIT is in Ireland and they follow the U UK. See, the question mentioned here is why everybody is offering masters of two years, whereas AIT is providing a masters in one year. What is the curriculum? What is the difference? Um, most of the countries are offering two years, even India offers two years master because your first year is postgraduate diploma and the second year is the master's. Whereas in AIT is like the UK system. The UK system is only one year masters if you check on the most of it. And they believe that you don't need to stretch your masters into two long years. You can complete it within one year and it, the curriculum is focused. You have theory, practicals, uh, plus you have industry visits. Uh, you have uh, in industry visits as well as with the National uh, Research Institute. You have a project with them. They take you for in. It's all included in this one year masters. I hope I've been able to answer your question. Okay. Uh, I request participants if you have any question on today's session, then please post it in the chat box. I will send you the flyer, the curriculum to Vaishali Madam, so she can forward it to all of you. So it gives yeah. you the course structure. Yeah. Uh, Vaishali Madam, I think there is no more question. There are no more questions. Students, if you have any questions, just we will wait for two minutes, sir. Okay, okay. We will wait for a few minutes uh, for questions. They are uh, typing, maybe some time they would require. Hmm. Yes, yes. Sure, no If there are questions, sir, let us know. Huh? Mm -hmm. Ajay, sir. Yes, yes, ma'am. The total cost for one year will be about 14 lakhs you're looking at. Okay, I have a question. How do we proceed for IELTS? Um, for IELTS, you, uh, you need to register with the British Council um, and they have, as I mentioned, every month, uh, the tests are conducted every month. We, uh, we, once you're uh, interested, uh, you can get in touch with Vaishali Madam and she will, or with us, and she will share the details. We will get you registered. You'll require your passport. Without a passport, you won't be able to appear for IELTS. So you require a passport. And if you do not have that, you'll have uh, six months to process that. Um, the IELTS is, uh, as I mentioned, it has four components. So we can help you with the registration, whereby we can also assist you if you go in for a pen and paper, the materials, the CD, everything will be couriered to you for study. You can register two months in advance, three months in advance, 
uh, because uh, three uh, the dates are given three months in advance. And once you register and you pay for the um, fees, that is, you have to pay to British Council directly. And uh, they send, uh, we are organized to, uh, uh, materials to come to you. So if you're doing a CD uh, computer based, then it is online. So we give you, they, uh, you get an access to free online, uh, um, I mean, testing uh, material and everything, mock tests for you. Um, there are. Uh, there's a question here. Are there any scholarship exams by which we could get stipend over there and abroad? See, there is. Uh, you're going in a one-year concise program, which is coursework. It's not a research-based work. It's coursework. So within after one year, you straight away are employable. So therefore, there is no scholarship in this, but because of the MOU between your college and AIT, you are um, entitled to a scholarship base, provided you have a 60% plus. Um, so you get about 2,000 euros scholarship. Um, and uh, there is no stipend as such. I mean, you are allowed to work as a student in Ireland for 20 hours part time per week. I would suggest that since you are, uh, it's a one year, very concise program, you should not look at working while studying because once you do well in your studies, you would be able to get a better job on completion. But if you are going to concentrate on part time work, Maybe during the uh, semester break, you can work on a pattern. But during studies, it's it's a very um, hectic to work and study and score well. Because unless you score well, you won't be able to pick up a good job at the end of the day. Have I answered your question or? What is ILT exam? Um, again, this is the same question. It's not ILT, it's I E L T S. So it's International English Language Test. That's they, that's your tested for your English language. And as I'm repeat, I'll repeat again, it has four components: listening reading, writing, and speaking. All these four components, you have to get a minimum score of six band and an overall score of 6.5. And to apply for it, I, you can get in touch with Vaishali Madam and she will uh, tell you how to, because we have links online for it to practice how to try, uh, tackle this exam. Um, the international recognition for this one year master's in other countries, it is recognized as an equivalent to master's degree in any country. So it's not that it won't be recognized anywhere, it, whether you look at US, uh, UK or any uh, Canada, any country, it's equivalent to a master's degree. Participants, any more questions? We'll wait again for two to three minutes uh, for the question. Vaishali, man, uh, you can share with them the link if those who are interested on how to tackle that the other day what yes. I sent you of British Council. Mm -hmm. 
yeah. how to how to approach these exams, how to tackle the exams. Yeah, I will share the link. I have shared with some people, few people, but uh, because I was not aware that how many students are interested. So yeah, as right. soon as yeah, I will contact them. That's why I told uh, them they can connect with you. Yes. It, these uh, these uh, seminars are conducted ev uh, every month. I mean, they are done. Uh, so basically, they can join in any time. Okay, okay. So they they will get, I think, more uh, to understand and learn about this exam. Okay. So, so sorry. Least, I uh, why should I, there are no more questions now. I think we have to conclude the session. Fine, fine, fine. Uh, so, uh, Madam, on behalf of Konkan Gyanpeet Ramu Dharkar College of Pharmacy, Karzir, uh, I would like to express my sincere thanks to you uh, for giving us the information on uh, AIT Institute as well as um, uh, telling uh, the students about the ILTS exam. And of course, even further, I will be uh, guiding them with your help about this exam and even uh, we are always uh, uh, able for the students to uh, solve any queries if they have so uh, even i would like to uh, thanks uh, principal sir for his support and uh, ajay sir for providing the technical support so thank you so much victoria madam for today's session so looking forward for uh, more sessions like this, even from Carl. So uh, that would be really beneficial for our students to understand more about this uh, institute as well as the education which they will be taking. Okay, so thank you, madam. Thank and you thank very you. much for having me on this platform. And thank you, uh, principals. Mr. Principal, as well as you all. Uh, we are there. And as I told you, I will communicate with you. Uh, we can have a session in the uh, whenever with Carl. So he can also uh, explain to them thing about the institution. But yeah. otherwise, we, we are always available for any queries and we can sort it out. OK, OK. Uh, madam, there is one more question from my side, actually. Uh, is there any yes. master's course available in management, like uh, business management? Or yes, there is, but not... Uh, um, uh, see, you can go... Uh, this uh, Somebody has written, is it better to go for master's in some other country or PhD? Now, I did not mention earlier, but AIT ha has a bio research faculty uh, institute in on campus. So the students on completion of masters who want to go into PhD can straight away go into a fully funded PhD. So uh, you, they because Ireland is a pharmaceutical hub in Europe, so basically, you will do very well in Ireland because your employability is higher, as well as research. If you are a research-based student, you can do well because it's fully funded. They have about 250 million euros available funding uh, available for research base. OK. So any other questions, students? So I think, Madam, there are no more questions. Uh, and uh, maybe on this master's in business management, uh, maybe you can provide that information me. See, we we do have a option of another program called the Master of Business in Pharmaceutical Industry uh, Marketing, which I can share with you the flyers. It's also mm -hmm. in Ireland, in Dublin. It's conducted in Dublin. So I can share with you that those students who want to do a business in pharmaceutical industry can also go into this program. But this in AIT, it's basically far, uh, more on a research based and uh, direct into the okay. pharmaceutical industry. Okay. 
there is one question uh, from Pumbi. no there is there is no distance learning course for farmer students because you have to do practicals your program is practical oriented so you have to go in for a research to the laboratory national uh, laboratory of uh, biopharmacy so basically this program cannot be done through distance learning Okay, so I think, Madam, there are no more questions now. Okay, so sure. thank you once again, Madam, and thank you for giving your valuable time to us. Uh, so thank you. Thank you. Thank you once again. All of you all stay well, stay safe. Yeah. Okay, Madam. Bye. Bye.